Greetings, I'm Dr. Bobby Price, your plant-based pharmacist and nutritionist, also author of Education Over Medication. And this is my detox instructional video. So first, let's talk about why doing a herbal full body detox is important. So we have all these processes, like every year we do a spring cleaning for our home. Every three to four months, we do an oil change and even sometimes we do a tune up on our cars but we have absolutely no process like that for our bodies. So that's why a herbal detox then becomes very important because it can get all the toxicity and acidity out of your body, which is actually causing you to have disease formation in your body, weight gain, and also inflammation. So the same way we clean our cars, we need to clean our houses. And that's why a detox is so important. And so my detox consists of two different um, products. So first you have the Parasite Candida Cleanse. Uh, the Parasite Candida Cleanse is exactly what it says. It gets rid of parasites and candidas that actually accumulate in our bodies, but it also cleanses our liver, our kidneys, and our lymphatic system. Uh, then we have our Tummy Detox, which actually cleanses out our digestive system. So if you have digestive issues or any issues uh, related to your digestion, uh, this is the part that cleans that out. So a lot of people do things like colon cleanses, uh, but your colon is only seven feet of your entire digestive tract, which is between 28 and 35 feet. So you have to clean the entire digestive tract. That doesn't just include the colon, but that includes the stomach, that includes the small intestines, the large intestines, and you also have to actually replace all that good bacteria that's probably been dissolved as a result of consuming a processed diet. So that's why a detox is very important. Uh, so the first thing I want to say is let's begin with what we need for the detox. So the first thing you're going to need is two jars and as you can see here I have two glass jars. Uh, they're amber. Uh, amber jars are good because they protect uh, anything you have inside of the jars from sunlight. Uh, you don't need that but I have them. Uh, so two jars that are 32 ounces. So this is 32 ounces, this is 32 ounces. The next thing you don't necessarily need, which but can be useful, is two mesh herb balls. So these are herb, herbal balls. You put the herbs inside of this, you close it up, and you can put it inside of each container. All that does for you is keeps the herbs separate from the water when you start to drink them. Uh, it's, so it's more of a convenience factor, not necessarily a necessity, okay? The next thing you're going to need is a tablespoon. Now I've, um, at this point we've had over a thousand people do the detox and uh, sometimes what people get is these measuring spoons. Now this is just a measuring spoon. Uh, a measuring spoon is not what you need, you just need a regular tablespoon. And as you'll see when I start to measure out the herbs, because you need two tablespoons of each herb in a separate jar. And when I measure them out, you're going to notice that when I scoop, it's not a heat. You have to flatten out the tablespoon. All right. The next thing you're going to need is your water. Now, I have two waters here. Uh, I'm not going to necessarily show you the brands, but both of them are naturally uh, natural spring water. So you need natural spring water bottled at the source, not just natural spring water uh, because you need it bottled at the source because then it doesn't go through a processing uh, that you need so uh, that you don't need actually so you get your natural spring water you got your two 32 ounce jars uh, glass jars they also can be stainless steel you got your herbal balls that you don't necessarily need but are very convenient and then you got your tablespoon not your measuring tablespoon do not use this one okay and then you got your herbs now I got my water over there boiling so it'll be ready in a minute, but what I'll do first is show you how to measure them, which is really important. So I'm gonna separate the two, uh, put one, uh, one set by one jar and the other set by another jar, because you're not going to be mixing them. You're not gonna be mixing the herbs together. You wanna keep them separate, okay? So this is the first, and let me just show you what the, because they do look different. Let me show you what the Parasite Candida looks like. So that is what the Parasite Candida looks like. It has all the herbs in there that get rid of all those nasty little critters like Parasites and Candida. Everything from Paul Dialco to Wormwood uh, to um, a few things like um, 
you know, uh, clothes, whole clothes. So um, everything you need in there that is necessary for you to get those little critters that are in there. So that is what that one looks like. And it looks totally different from the actual Tommy T-Tox. But what we want to do is measure off, as I said before, a flat um, tablespoon. So I'm going to flatten that off. And as you can see, that is a flat tablespoon, not a heap. So that is one tablespoon, and I'll put that inside of this jar. Okay. And then we'll take another tablespoon, again, a flat tablespoon, and that's just about right. All right, so that's a flat tablespoon, as you can see. So two tablespoons in one jar. We can close that one up. We're done with that one. And now we're going for the Tommy Tea Tox. Again, the Tommy Tea Tox is made of several herbs. All of them are designed to actually uh, heal your gut. And as you can see, that's kind of a flat tablespoon. This one has cascara sagrada, dandelion, rhubarb, sage, senna, slippery elm, and marshmallow. So uh, you can kind of see that one looks totally different from the actual Parasite Candida Cleanse. Uh, it has barks, it has herbs in there, it has leaves. So uh, it has everything you need to clean out your gut. So. Uh, we're going to just make sure that one is flat as well. And again, you can see what a flat tablespoon looks like. All right, so that's one. And measure off one more. And as you can hear, my water is just about ready. That's another. That's two. And that is all we need. So now I'm going to get my water. I'll be right back. All right, so now we just want to fill the jar up to the neck or elbow of the jar. Done. Now this one, fill it up to the neck or the elbow. Put a little bit much in that one. And then at this point, you're just going to simply close it up. Now, as you can see, I decided not to use the herbal balls. As I said before, they are not necessary. I like mine more so without using the herbal balls, but you can choose to use them if you want to. I just don't decide to use them. And the cool thing about this is that you are actually done. You could either decide to Put this in the refrigerator or you can leave this out overnight. So typically I make my uh, herbal infusions around about 6 p.m. the night before and then I let them sit out overnight. I let them sit out on the counter overnight and that's fine to do. Uh, some people say it tastes better so they put those theirs in the refrigerator but it's totally up to you. You can either let them sit out here uh, on the counter overnight or you can decide to put them inside of the refrigerator. And that is it. That, took, that will take you maybe three or four minutes to do every night. And so you're going to be doing this consistently uh, every day during your detox, whether you're doing a 14 day or whether you're doing a 28 day or whether you're in my group and doing the 30 day group detox. So this is what you will be doing every night, making these two herbal infusions. So now the question then becomes, you let them sit out overnight and then you let the herbs infuse inside of the water. Um, which one do you drink first and when do you start drinking? Well, I always tell people first start drinking them as soon as you wake up in the morning. So as soon as you kind of get out of the bed and get situated, you can start drinking the herbal infusions. Which one to drink first? It does not matter uh, which one you drink first. You can choose to either drink the Parasite Candida, you can choose to drink the Tommy Tetox. Either one does not, uh, it doesn't matter. A lot of people typically choose the Tommy Tea Tops because they say it tastes better, uh, but in my opinion, uh, they taste about equal. So that kind of moves me into the sort of uh, big question that people are always asking about the herbal detox, the bitter taste. Um, yes, they're very bitter, but let me explain why and why that is very important. Uh, on the back of your tongue, uh, you have the taste bud for bitterness. And the beautiful thing about that is in nature, all the things that are very bitter uh, are also very alkaline and high in minerals. And when you're, that hits, sensation hits the back of your taste buds, 
it stimulates your stomach, uh, your pancreas, your liver, your uh, kidneys to start detoxing. Uh, it also stimulates your uh, pancreas and your stomachs to start releasing uh, digestive enzymes, uh, which is very healthy for you. Now, if you were to take this in a capsule, you would not get that benefit, and that's why they're not in the capsule. So, very important point. Uh, yes, it's, very, it's bitter, and it's especially bitter if you've never had uh, herbal infusions um, before. But what I can tell you is this, and uh, many people who have done the detox can sort of, uh, you know, uh, lay claim to this as well. Uh, after about four to five days of doing the herbal detox, the taste uh, is not as bitter anymore. Uh, it never tastes really good, but uh, it's definitely not as bitter. And so I always tell people my motto behind tasting things or uh, ingesting things that don't necessarily taste good, but are good for you is I taste results. And so that's how you have to take this approach is this is a self-loving uh, process. So you have to take it as you're tasting results with this detox. I hope this has been helpful. You can always go to my website. I have a tab, frequently asked questions that you can check out all these questions. And uh, as I said before, happy detoxing.